Hi, I'm Phil. I'm Diba. Welcome to our quick review of Balvini Doublewood. Uh, it's 12 year old, right? Yes, age 12 years. A ABV is 43. Yeah, just 43 ABV. This is about a $50 bottle and um, we didn't pay anything because we got it from our friend Steve. <laughs> okay, the new song is really good in this, all right? You'll love it. It's a wee dram. <laughs> Sorry about that. Thanks, Steve. Ah, <laughs> Steve. In our blind tasting, we called this one Nutty Orangeson. And um, it is, well, let's find out what it is. I put an apple dip water, it's up to the 43. Yeah, at 43, we probably won't add water. We did feel it was a bit sort of like the flavors were a bit distant, right? Okay. Very nutty. Nutty? I have the walnut. Walnut? I've got faint, light sherry. A bit orange oil. And uh, uh, ether herbs. Heather herbs. Now, double wood. So it is in two oak barrels, yes. right? So the first one presumably is a ex-bourbon barrel. The second one is a European oak sherry, sherry barrel. So. The European oak should be giving a little bit of spiciness to balance with the vanilla from the mm. um, American white oak. But it's unusual <clears throat> from the walnut oil. Yeah. Okay, have a taste. I just feel like I'm always trying to like, come on, a bit closer, a bit closer. Oh, it's beautifully balanced, but it's got for dint. Balance and confidence. Oh, you will not order it. It's very good. You know, if if I'd been offered this as something to taste, I'd be thinking, oh, it probably won't be that good. Balvini, mm, a bit too soft. But mm -hmm. we tasted it blind. We really liked it. Wow. It is a little bit weak, or should I say the, the flavors are ask. soft. They are soft, they are balanced. Yes. So it's not like it's punching above its weight or anything. It's, it's more uh, middle of the road, but it does it really, really well. Hold on a second. In our blind tasting, going for Ben's thistle glass here, we had picked out Glendronic 18 to do a side by side, which is this one. This is a bottle that costs, what, three times as much? And ABV is 46, 43. 46 ABV. Yeah. Billy Walker, Glendronic. This is probably a 23 year old in this bottle. Now I have to say, if you're the type of person who likes sherry, this is way better. A deeper, rich sherry. But we have been sort of a little put off by the sherry. I am, I think it's aggressive. I is not smooth for. Of exponent, but the, the exponent is a beautiful flow. Yeah, glassy smooth. In our blind tasting, we said we would rather have this than yes. this for our flavors, for our taste flavors. Oops. Now. Yeah, I, I'm, I, I'm very surprised, but. That's what it is. I'm sure there's a lot of people who like sherry out there that are just saying, no, what are they talking about? If you don't like sherry, this is probably better. Here's the thing though. And it's also softer. If I pull up um, Brookladdy Isla Barley, <laughs> we're running out of glasses. This is a bend. 
Josh. This isn't a quick review anymore, but Isle of Barley is like farmyard in a glass. <laughs> the thing is, we actually like these more than the sherry. I'm very alive. It's, uh, it's just gifts from the countryside, but it's fresh. Okay, but, uh, I'm going to do something outrageous with our lineup. It is not fresh. I'm going to take these four and move them back up. I'm not happy better, and I'm happy now. Yeah, we've made a lot of un a lot of other people unhappy with that, I think. Yeah. <laughs> but we're happy, and it's our shelf.